dismantling a dot journey or fiat frame up door mirror. I will be going in order, removing the mirror glass, cover, and other components. So I had a mirror that had a broken mirror glass that I can work on. We always start off by removing the mirror glass. I use plastic tools. You want it to be very gentle on all sides. Just partially remove from every angle. You do not want to force it from one side only. And then it's only held on by clips on the inside of the mirror glass. And then it should come out quite easily without too much force. Next, if the mirror glass is heated, you'll need to unplug. Here are the clips that hold the mirror glass in place. Now for the mirror cover on the inside, this is why you need to remove the mirror glass. There are these clips that run all along around on the inside of the mirror cover. And we are going to be just unclipping all of them as we go. I won't be editing this part of the video so you can see that it just takes a bit of patience and time. And you want to make sure you unclip properly and then it will eventually come out quite easily once you unclip. If you unclip one side and then you're doing unclipping another side, sometimes the other ones can go back in. It does get a bit annoying, but you will need, just need to be patient and just unclip. And then once you unclip completely, it will come off quite easily. So this is how you remove the mirror cover. Next for the motor on the mirror glass, there are three torque screws. So you do these three on the motor and then you can take off this motor that holds the mirror glass. For the rest of the mirror, we remove this torque screw here and then another two on the inside. These ones over here. This mirror can be completely dismantled to change the surround for the assembly itself. Once you remove these three four screws, so you can take off the motor, unplug the motor, 